A failed attempt to log in may be out of human error and can be corrected in a couple of attempts. If we set this value to more than a few attempts, we may allow a malicious system to gain access into the firewall with repeated attempts and control the device. Setting a low number of failed attempts allows users who make typing errors to retry the login a reasonable number of times, while preventing malicious systems from trying to access the firewall with repeated login attempts until they gain access. You have been redirected to the Welcome to the BPA Plus screen from a BPA report or from the Get Help section. The first step is to click Browse Files to upload the latest text support file. Navigate to the text support file and click Open. Now that the text support file has been successfully uploaded, we can continue to the next step in the process. Click Next. This screen lets you know how to set up your PanOS CLI. We also recommend that you back up your existing configuration before you start making any configuration changes on your firewall. Along with the recommended best practice commands, BPA Plus will also provide a command to take a backup of your existing configuration. Click Next. The list here shows the failed BPA checks. For the purpose of this demo, we will remediate the failed attempts BPA check. Click Next. This displays the failed attempts. At the top it says please review the best practice setting and select the desired options for your configuration. By default, this screen will show best practice settings. The settings highlighted in blue are the settings that are being changed to adhere to the best practices. If you click on Existing Setting, you will see the setting that you have in your configuration. You will see a note at the top that says, are you sure you want to deselect the best practice setting for this profile? We advise against this as it will make your system less secure. You want to take action against the failed best practice check. So we will click the best practice setting and click next. The next section is to generate set commands. At the top, you can see a download all commands button. This is useful for remediating multiple best practice checks when you want to download a file with all the recommended best practice commands. Now below are the list of best practice recommendation commands along with the command to take a backup of your existing configuration. Now we'll click copy commands. The next step is to open an SSH session to the firewall. Now paste the commands in the CLI. As you can see there are no warnings. We are good for the purposes of this demo. I will perform a commit operation. As you can see the configuration was committed successfully. So as a next step, we will check our firewall settings. In the firewall, under the authentication settings, failed attempts is already set to zero. So I'll refresh my firewall page. Now you can see under device for management, the authentication setting failed attempts is set to five. This concludes the demo.